Hello everyone. How are you guys doing? I am not doing as good today as I was yesterday. Um, so I just wanted to hop on because I just felt like sharing. Um, I decided today I got up and I was house cleaning. I was like deep house cleaning. And um, throwing away a lot of things. <clears throat> Excuse me, y'all. Oh, my Lord. I threw away a lot of things. Um, cleaned out, rearranged some things, and bought some things. Y'all, I don't know. Maybe I did too much. Um, I started sweating. I started getting really hot. And it was like worse than hot flashes. It was like, oh God, I feel sick, you know. Um, but I was able to get everything done and um, I got new car, well, new area rug. I put that down and um, I'll, I'll show it to you. There's the new area rug. It doesn't cover up the stains as much as the other one, the other rug did. But at least it's not a shag rug, right? At least I can vacuum over it without crumbs or things, you know, being like harbored inside that the um, vacuum cleaner can't pick up. Um, I clean, cleaned the window ledges. I was really happy to be up and about. And I guess, guys, I guess I overdid it. I guess I overdid it. So, um... I decided to just sit here and go through my planner, my main planner. Now, most of you or some of you have already seen this planner. Um, but for those who have not seen it, this is my main everyday um, planner. Um, the cover here is the Sakura or Sakura melody planner in the classic size and i got this from planners anonymous i don't think that they have it this i got this like years ago and i actually got mine from ebay <clears throat> but it is the cherry blossom sakura classic size melody planner and um Inside of here, I just have some stickers and some tip-ins and cards and, um, I mean, it is February, right? So that's fitting, but actually that was there. I put that on there a long time ago. Had nothing to do with thanks, uh, what do you call it? Whatever this holiday is, is coming up. Valentine's Day. And this is just a pouch where I keep all my pen refills that are for here and that's it um i am a snoopy fan i don't know if you guys know that or not but i love snoopy and when i saw may from black mountain plans i found out a long time ago that she too is a snoopy fan and i had no idea that pentel had these Snoopy pens. So I went on my stationery pal <clears throat> years ago and got these Snoopy pens with refills. This one writes black. <clears throat> no, I'm sorry guys. This one writes blue. Um, these are coming off. These are refills um, little storage pouches for the happy planner stickers and for some reason y'all it seemed like it don't want to stay on the ring today so <clears throat> wow guys I'm starting to feel like maybe I shouldn't do a video because I'm just not doing well this would be perfect for me to do ASMR all right, um, this one writes a, a metallic blue. And I was going to show you. Hold on. This little booklet here. I just have that on the bar. And it is a bunch of boxes. 
prayer and <clears throat> prayer and praise. Um, she, uh, she who dares wins, and I just use them for my weekend um, to dos. And then there's some smaller ones, so I just keep this on the bar. Actually, I have it attached to this right here, and it just stays there. It was just something I had, no big deal. Um, so I was going to show you. Hold on. I can't get it together, guys. <laughs> I can't get it together. All right, here's a post-it note. So this is a really dark medium point as you can see and I love how that writes and that's the blue and this one is the black and as you can see it is a very thick dark black I wrote my name so pathetic <laughs> oh lordy lordy Oh my goodness. And this one, I'm sure you guys can guess that the color is going to be pink. And it's hard to tell on here, but it is a nice, um, pretty pink. All right, so enough with that. So this is this cover, guys, I got from Small Box of Treasures on Etsy. And she does custom made happy planner covers. She also does Erin Condren. So if you have a photo of some scenery that you like, um, you can go and send it to her and she will make it for you front and back cover. And I thought that matched the Sakura Cherry Blossom Melody perfectly. Um, this was a gift from my husband. And I just tore it out of the book and punched it. Alrighty, righty, righty. This was like when I had first started <laughs> brush writing. And I was using a fin fin um, Fudenosuke, which was a very firm um, brush pen and I it I, I had no luck with it um, here is just some scrap paper that I got from Etsy years ago that I put together for that um, wherever life plants you bloom with grace I love that and this is the um, and I forgot simply gilded um, washi tape right here on the bottom and the top um, and so I, I, I'm sure I did a share of this before, but you know, if you if you've seen this before, go ahead and just turn me off and watch somebody else. <laughs> but um, these are all different scrapbook pages and boxes and different things that I just had threw together like over a year ago. No, a year ago. Um, this is where I'm at today. I have to check the plants and water them. All of this stuff is, I'm done with. Um, I do not save these. This is not a memory keeper in any way. Um, once I'm done, I throw it in the trash. Um, so you will not see January. You will not see February prior to this because once I'm done, I'm done. Um, but this is washi tape that came from planners anonymous this was i believe either wrong uh, yeah this was wrong wrong definitely and all of this here that you see was custom made from black mountain plants um and this is what i do instead of writing it over and over every day um, I had this made in the handwritten font so and I put the little dot I have my dot pen right there and my highlighter and I just dot a.m. p.m. hormones a.m. p.m. vitamins a.m. p.m. stretches and broth a.m. p.m. gappy um, gappy groom vacuum power walk 
these are the things that I have to always make sure that I do. And when it comes to the hormones and the vitamins and the stretches I and the broth, you know, I, I just put an X over these to let me know, hey, I did this already. Because sometimes I will say, did I take my vitamins already? Or did I take my PMs, you know? And I have an alarm that goes off, but sometimes guys, I'm busy. And it's like, I can't get to it right now. I'll do it in a minute. And then a minute goes by and it's an hour. So, you know, even though I have an alarm on my phone, I always make sure that I check off that I vacuumed or that I power walked or whatever it is that was, you know, something that I tend to forget. Like right now, I vacuumed the whole house except for the dining room because that was where I did my last cleaning. So I need to vacuum that. Um, and so it's the same thing here. Um, this is estrogen. I'm increasing my estrogen. So on Tuesdays, it's just going to be one more click. But as you can see, guys, it's the same thing repeated. Um, I don't remember. Oh, yes, this is I believe this is also from Planners Anonymous. And these sheets that I stick in the middle here. This is for any priorities for this side of the week. Um, and then when third Friday comes, I just flip it over. And then whatever I need to write down extra, I have all this space here um, to write it down. Um, here's Friday. It's AM, PM, Gappy, Gappy Groom hormones, vitamins, stretches, broth, vacuum. And then Friday is always the busiest day of the week for me because it's the day that I have the most stuff to do. My mini pedicure, shave, estro, iodine, laundry. Um, and sometimes it's more than that. This, however, is a light week. I no longer fill out Saturday and Sunday. I just... I just don't. I I just I just don't fill out Saturday and Sunday anymore. I just I want to be off from as much stuff as I possibly can be off from. So that is why I left that blank. But I'm going to just show you just just to share with you how I decorated. This came from Happy Planner and um the washi tape came from Planners Anonymous and as you can see I have not finished I just had some extra stickers that I needed to put somewhere so I just put them on here um, but that is what that is so that's what I just felt like sharing this is what they call the currently page and I don't use the currently page and I also I don't use the monthly um, this planner is it's just so I can remember you know certain things you know that that's that's all certain things that I may tend to um, forget so really that's all it is um I got a new light bulb <laughs> and the light in here is not that good anymore um, I tried a different color and I should have stayed with the bright daylight, but now it, it puts a tint on things. Um, it I don't I don't get it. it. Like my wedding bands and rings almost look like they have a gold tint to it, and they're pure sterling silver. And I don't know why I see gold tints in them, but what whatever, right? It whatever. <laughs> it's just crazy. Um. So I do apologize if, you know, colors look weird to you guys or whatever, but these, there is a, a, a brownish like tint um, that I can, I can see. So I'm going to have to replace the bulbs with the daylight. Um, what do you guys like? Do you like the daylight or you like white light? Um so anyway, I, I created this. All of these was just from stickers from um, Planners Anonymous. So 
If you're still with me, I appreciate it that we can just sit here and just go through this planner um, that, you know, most people do a plan with me where you watch them just decorate. And really, that's it. <laughs> you just watch them decorate and chat. Um, so I'm just showing you what I already decorated ahead of time. And all of these are stickers that were from um, Kel of a Plan. Um, that was from Kel of a Plan. I'm almost certain if it wasn't Kel of a Plan, um, it was from Live Love Posh. Um, I don't remember, guys, because it, like I said, I put this together early last year. I know actually a year before that, I had this for a very long time and I just didn't have the opportunity to use it these here are from um, planners anonymous so yeah this was this was actually done in 2022 for me to use in <laughs> um, 2024 um, excuse me it was this was done early 20 and mid yeah early 2023 come on Pam get it right yeah I did this or er, this time last year pretty much because I had gotten a discount on um old uh happy planners and uh let me see it was Black Friday of 2022 that I got this and I put it together and I was decorating it all throughout the uh, early part of 2023. But I purchased this in 2022. So that's why you see all of this covered up stuff, all of, um, pages that are actually stuck, glued together um, and things of that nature and old stickers because the this that's when this was put together so um i love that that is so cute and it is all from planners anonymous if i am not mistaken but i believe that is where it was from i love that that is so cute the fashion and the nail polishes and you guys who know me you know i'm really really um a florals person um, I'm not really into much of the elements and the, you know, little icons or whatever you want to call them. I'm just pretty much floral. And I don't like the seasonal thing. I like to be able to use whatever colors, combinations that I can use any time of the year, you know. And it just gives me that freedom. And it's like, you know, how you have your Christmas um, sticker book well then you put it away right and you can't use it anymore until um later than you know until that next year so this is my currently page for may um and yeah and so you you don't get to enjoy your um your stickers because the season for it is over so that is why i like um uh, florals that are just not seasonal that I can just use any time of the year and it just be okay um, I'm, I'm sure that I'm not going to do any more decorating because I write big and I just need space and like I said I don't save these I love this right here that is handwritten font by Black Mountain Plans and it came in a kit and I don't think that she has this font in this size available anymore but um, I love that it's just that it doesn't match well I mean I guess you could say it sort of does because you have the green in the Sakura and then that's the same green and then you have that green there but it's to me it's not enough green so I don't know why I put that there um, why I didn't pay attention better 
Um, I like this. I like how that turned out. Now this was from Planners Anonymous and this was the October Halloween um, label um, dates. Um, but I used them in May because I just wanted to do the purple and black thing. And then there's the cat that looks like my Andy. I mean, so I just put that color combination together. And then here is the currently page Tybo, physical therapy, deck time. You know, it's not really a currently like you guys do, like I'm currently watching or I'm currently reading. It is really just whatever. <laughs> it's, it's really just whatever. All right, so here's June. I'm sorry, I haven't been reading these. It says, be patient, be loving, be kind, be gentle. And I don't remember what planner from Happy Planner this is. Like, I don't remember what the name of it is. Sorry. Um, gosh, that orange tint is driving me crazy. When I look <laughs> through the camera and then I look at it, in real, you know, uh, it's, I see a difference. I see a difference. But I know it's not the camera. I know it is the light, that light bulb. So that is really, um, oh yeah, I love these. These, I, this was actually, um, paper. Not, um, this was glued down because it was, it came from scrapbook paper. And that is for June. Let me move this out of the way. And as you can see, I stopped decorating with the washi. I kind of took a break on that one. And then here, I didn't, I think I pretty much stopped. I don't think I finished. Because I do have some flowers left. So that is that on that and it's here it says seek beauty in all things and I decorated that now see guys I can use this forever and ever and ever because I covered the back of it up and that's what I like I like being able to just recycle and have options now this page of course will get trashed because it has that on it and so here we get into July And it's, it's getting a little bit more plainer, as you can see, because I pretty much stopped decorating. I like how that turned out. That's cute. This is pretty. It says, she loves the smell of warm coffees, bloomed roses, and new beginnings. And a lady by the name of Sonia Azalea said that. And I love those flowers. Those, oh, that is so pretty. So did you guys pick up anything from Live Love Posh? Anything from the new uh, kit that they have? Well, not kit, but the elements. The seasonal elements. And I did tell you guys I was going to pick up the new pastel florals. I think I told you. Um, spring floral so I, I my bad but the pastel florals so I did pick that up so I look forward to getting that but I also picked up the I think it's chic spring there were so many pretty pretty florals and, and lined florals and stuff that was in that book that I just didn't notice before so I'm grateful to, for flip throughs. Can I just say this? I am grateful for people who take the time to do flip throughs because y you never know what you might miss. And sometimes looking at something on a website, you might say, eh, it's okay. But when you see up close with someone who has really good filming and really good lighting and you see the detailing and you see how well you know the artwork is you're like oh wow you know I didn't realize how pretty that was or if you see someone using it in a spread you know 
And it's like, oh, okay, here's a great idea. That's why I love so much about how May always uses her stuff in her spreads and shows you how you can use it. Same thing with Robin from Oh Robin, Oh Hello Robin. So I love that. I absolutely love that because there have been things where I was like, nah, I'll pass. And then I actually get a really good flip through and I'm like, hey, you know, that's actually prettier than I thought. So that was the case with the Live Love Pa Chic Spring. Um, this too, these words, these dates, uh, days of the week, that too is li um, Black Mountain Plans. But this here is Narrative Hues. Do you guys still use Narrative Hues? I don't hear people talk about narrative hues that much but I'm sure she's still on the ball I'm sure she's still selling I need to actually check out her 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 store her um shop what have you because I have not purchased from narrative hues in a long time I have a lot of her um strips and this is our wedding anniversary so that's when I went ahead and used the um live love posh uh new year's thing because i mean really so this is where i left off at so really this this is the new year's theme but <laughs> who's gonna know i mean it's great for um wedding anniversaries or birthdays you know um just trying to see here if there was anything that I I need to redate these parts. So this was, you know, I showed you guys where I left off at. And then he, all of this is Live Love Posh as well. And I think this is so cute. Have nothing in your, what is that word, in your houses that you do not know to be useful or believe to be beautiful. I like that. I just, I don't know why I forgot what that word was. I don't, I don't. I got some glasses on. All right. It ain't doing a daggone bit of good. All righty. I love this. All of this came from AliExpress. All of this stationary paper. So, and um, here, wedding anniversary. So, I went ahead and used up as many of those stickers as I could. That's a note. Because when I redate... Um, and I don't know why I would write down October has 31 days in it. Everyone knows October has 31 days in it. That's when Halloween is. So why would I write that? I don't know. And this is in, um, in respect of breast cancer. And then here is my little spooky um, Halloween. I just can't believe I wrote a note to myself that Hollow, um, October had 31 days. And then here's some more Halloween stuff. I just wanted to use up the stickers. That's why I say, guys, I really do not like to buy a lot of seasonal stickers. Um, and there, there's more of Halloween and then I changed the color scheme because now we're getting into November. So November is going to be about those fall sunflowers that I like so, so much. And I used washi tape, I believe I did, um, for the labels. And there I, that's where I literally stopped. Yep. That's where I believe I literally stopped. Oh, okay, there's Christmas. I had some dollar store, I think, type Christmas um, stickers that I wanted to get rid of. So I put that on there. And let's see, in the back of here, guys, is, um, and I know I've showed you guys this before, but for those who have not seen it, all of this was from planners anonymous and that was from happy planner and it's just a little section of decorative paper for priorities 
and things like that. And then that's the end of the um, book. And then there's some extra pages in there. The sticker paper. And that's it. So, you know, I'm glad that I took the pages out when I was done with them. Because now the book will be easier. It'll be easier to turn the pages. So anyway, guys, um, I want to thank you for hanging out with me. Um, if you have seen this flip through before and and this is a repeat for you, thank you for staying and just listening anyway. Um, I enjoy your company and I hope to see y'all in the next video. Bye.